a model, but as you're about to see, more than just a pretty face. What I tried to do was to form an illusion in a sense because I am one of the smallest ones in the lineup, and I'll always be one of the smallest ones, but I had to form some kind of an illusion in a sense where I look bigger than what I am, than my, what my weight really is. And that is just making the waist very small and working on the lats as wide as possible and just bringing up good quality muscle. And speaking of charisma, Frank, do you think Gladys has succeeded in her bodybuilding plan? Dorothy, I can relate to her plan all right because of the same plan I had. Uh, I was probably the most slender Mr. Olympia. And I had to create this illusion of size on stage, too. But if you're in top shape, like Gladys is, and you, she does have that small waist you can see there, she does create the illusion of having more size than she actually does. You know, Frank, Gladys told me she began bodybuilding because her friends were kidding her about being so skinny. I could stand that kind of kidding. I think most women could, no doubt about that, but Gladys wants to be more than just skinny. She wants to have development, and she has the charisma. She's really a total performer. You get the impression that when she's posing, she's loving every minute of it. There you can see how small her waist is. There must be under 20. No, I know she's a little nervous because she's a New York girl, and her mom is in the audience, and she told me that makes her more nervous than any judges. She certainly doesn't look nervous to me. performance. New York 